On this Wednesday, June 2nd, we thank you for joining us for the PIX11 Morning News. I'm John Muller. Good morning. Happy Wednesday. I'm Vanessa Freeman. We start you off with a check of your weather and traffic with mm -hmm. Marissa Torres. It's Tuesday. It's, what, what is it? It's Tuesday? Yeah, not Wednesday. Is that, it is Tuesday. Wednesday. It is, it is Wednesday. Wednesday. Oh, it's yeah, Wednesday. It's Memorial Day, right, it seems right. it, but oh wow. yeah, you better believe it. I thought wow. you were just trying to stump me because last night I really had to ask my husband, what day is it? Yeah. It's tomorrow, Tuesday. There we go. So some good news. Some good news. We were Hump officially day. in summer. We're officially in, or I'm sorry, not summer, meteorological summer. We're officially in June. Gosh, we are off today. Uh, right now, temperatures, let's start there in the boroughs. You have the city, Central Park at 63, bed at 61, Patterson as we take it to close-up Jersey at 62. Winds are out of the southwest, a little milder than where we were yesterday, noticing everybody pretty much waking up in the upper 50s at least. You have 54 up in Newburgh, 5 degrees warmer in the city compared to this time yesterday. Islip, 10 degrees warmer. Look at West Hampton, really enjoying that 18 degrees warmer uh, temperature. So the satellite radar picture picking up on yet again some clouds, some of those high clouds coming in. We're actually getting some of this from an area of low pressure off to the west. So they're coming in from the southwest. We're looking at a mainly dry caught on camera. Sucker punching an Asian American woman in Chinatown. This comes as we learn about a new attack on another Asian American. PIX 11's Rebecca Solomon live in Chinatown. Sadly, with more on this. Good morning, Rebecca. On this. Good morning, Rebecca. They're filtering in from an area of low pressure still off to the west. Now you still have that front stalled to the south of us. This will lift as a warm front and that's going to trigger some showers for tomorrow morning. Right. And then we have a cold front swinging in attached to this area of low pressure coming in um, later on Thursday for Friday. Both could trigger some rain Thursday looking like the wettest day today. We're starting off dry just with some clouds that are going to be hanging in there. We do have a chance for some isolated showers. Maybe Business owners are seeing more folks coming through their doors and with increasing demand comes the need to hire more people. But some New York City bars and restaurants are having a tough time with that. Pix 11's Christian top of the hour. We'll take it over to the Gowanus to start eastbound a crash that is blocked. So we are ready for it. Subway. So it is 619 uh, reports of a a bike under a train at First Avenue. So they're trying to get the problems bike. on the New Jersey Turnpike, the Western Spur southbound hearing New Jersey Turn Turnpike Western Spur mentioned this closure earlier. Well, Air 11 now over the scene and what First Avenue. So they have their hands full there. A lot of service changes that they're continuing to work with and delays with rails this morning. Major commuter rail lines. Everybody's on or close to schedule. So good news there. Couple of reminders for you. So L.A. double R Montauk schedule changes. That will kick in later this morning around 8. We're walking the halls of Bergenfield High School, going into classrooms, looking at the technology they have in place, talking to students. He went into the band room and listened to the band practice. Uh, so they got a we real. We got the lovely Vanessa Freeman in with us, and we got the whole <laughs> gang here. Yes. Hey. Hey. Thanks for being with us. Uh, what did um, I miss? Uh, there's an old saying, but I'll let that go. Oh. <laughs> what? Dirty, no, 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 no. You can't do that. What? Say it. Dirty tub water. Oh. Oh. That yeah, let so it go. Fine. I drink her dirty tub water. Oh, okay. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. You should let that go. That, that was our fault. We should have encouraged that one. Yeah, I know. Okay. Ben told me to say it. It's a compliment, right, so Let's talk about what's happening right now. Uh, your temperatures at the south, up to 60s to the low 70s. Up Birkenfield High School, along with the U.S. Education Secretary, Yes, there he reaffirmed plans to have all schools in the Garden State back to in-person learning this fall. Icon Celia Cruz will be honored today. Pix 11's Kirsten Cole is live in the Bronx. I need to tell you about it because he got a lot of people shocked on so I, as your first guest. Okay, mm -hmm. that is our big mm -hmm. question today. Visit our website. To wear body cameras. Governor Phil Murphy says it's an effort to oh, do the show, shall we? Mm -hmm. It's, um, I am excited. <laughs> These puns are awful. We're squashing any rumors. Do you get that one? About seasonal veggies, sharing tips for freshness and recipe ideas that will have you saying broccoli. <laughs> <laughs> but first, Ben's cooking up some birthday chef. Eating up. Meet her all just by Miranda joins us. With we need too much yeah. water. Yeah. But yeah. I, I taste the potential. <laughs> well, that's the vegetable. I swear, she is little I Miss taste, Sunshine. I, I taste the potential. The potential. I do taste, I'm telling oh, you, you it like, has, he's, he's it a, has a lovely dictator. aroma. I know, right? That smell. <laughs> it smells like a good soup. <laughs> These yes. critiques. I taste the potential. I love the aroma. <laughs> what does that say, Ben? It's not me, it's the bomb. Yeah, okay. All right. 